Let me fix everything and because there is always something to do to be ironed, I usually fix stuff but today I will do a review. Not that it's really needed, but with this iron, steam iron, Philips 6300 series, exact model number is uh, GC6310 and you can see here 85 grams of pressure, three and a half bars, yeah? So I have a pan here of kids clothing. I'm not really good at ironing. I actually never iron, I just had to repair this one, so uh, yeah. I just need to run it for a while to see if it runs properly. And while I run it, I'll make a little video about, uh, about it. Maybe maybe someone needs it, yeah. With 58, 85 grams of pressure, I was thinking when I, I was looking at AdWords about that 85 grams a minute, it's uh, insufficient, but I'll tell you, I did a little bit of ironing with it. 85 grams of, pressure, of uh, steam, it's pretty good, it's okay, definitely enough, if you need more, I don't know, I don't know what you're gonna iron with it, yeah this one is fine, does not stick, important was to not stick to anything, it's not brand new but it doesn't stick to I got it set up to the highest setting. Yeah. And I don't iron on an ironing table, I wear on my wooden table, kitchen table, with a piece of terry cloth underneath. Can I iron on top of this? And you can lock the button as well, so it constantly produces steam. Can you do better? Very nice. <coughs> uh, just enjoy your coffee. Mm. If it's winter time, this is brilliant. If it's summer time, gonna boil. So hot on top of this. Uh, on this iron, throw that steam. If you bought one, because you probably bought it second hand, tell me in the comments how much did you spend on it. I had a look in the Philips website and it says uh, it stops from manufacturing, so you can't buy it anymore. But it's nice, it's okay. Maybe for you it's important to see how how good it does without the, the steam. Also does pretty well. Almost into my coffee. This pipe onto 
here. It's pretty long also, you know. Almost like two meters of pipe. Then you have a meter and a half of cord. So you can just set it up somewhere around your uh, table and run it from there. It, it can be on the floor as well because it's pretty heavy, around five kilos it weights. And when you top it up with water, it's even more heavier so it can tip your table. I got it set up onto the chair here. Otherwise there is no space enough on my table for it. Should I give it a hit with the, with the steam? Steam is the best thing. If you don't use the steam, don't buy it. How do you have a little stain on the back, my friend? How do you fold that? No clue. Yeah, this looks good. My button doesn't work properly. To the oh yeah it does I don't think this one needs ironing, but still, let's go. Oh, no, no, no. Nope, not this one. This one is like a synthetic material and I can burn it through. I don't know if you can see, but definitely no. I'm not touching it. Primark. Did you notice in Primark the clothing is drastically more expensive than a few years ago and drastically more bad quality? It's on the same material. It is again from Primark. It's insane, no? No, I'm not touching. You got synthetic additive inside it. So, <coughs> let's see, like these t-shirts, the cotton ones. No, but maybe if I lower the temp, huh? still. When you're looking for an iron, what do you look for? Price maybe? To be cheap? To be expensive? To be beautiful?
Oh, uh, should we finish with that review? Yeah, we'll finish it here. 10 minutes. It's doing just fine. We got so much steam. How long if it does 85 grams a minute? That's like not letting a button off for like 20 minutes maybe if it gets I don't know what is the tank capacity but it's more more than a liter more like two liters almost good well I hope this video is being helpful to you and I'll see you until the next one bye bye